Hey, make sure you join the Discord. The link can be found down below in the description. What is going on YouTube? This video is dedicated to one of the most underrated pulse rifles in Destiny. Now, I know underrated is a big word to say, especially in this kind of meta where we have a lot of contending pulse rifles like Elsie's. However, I do feel like this pulse rifle will be meta or maybe just very, very strong when 340s get nerfed. Guys, it's inevitable. 340 pulses are eventually going to get nerfed. I think we all know that. So you guys can kind of just dismantle that Elsie's really quick. All right, all jokes aside though, the uh, pulse rifle we're talking about is called Disparity. This was released in uh, Season of Seraph. Now, luckily, if you guys want to test this thing out for yourself and you do have five harmonizers, you can craft this thing. How are you guys going to get it? Well, right now, Banjee is selling a pretty good roll. The roll that Banjee is selling right now as this video is being posted is Rapid Hit Kill Clip. Now, initially, to be honest with you guys, I was kind of hesitant when I saw the fact it was a 450, but it actually hits really, really well. And uh, yeah, now one thing I do think that contends disparity versus LCs is definitely the fact that we have the ambush origin trait. What ambush does is it improves range handling and damage against combatants during the opening moments of an engagement. This is kind of like opening shots but a little less complicated. You guys will see it a lot too in gunfights. If you do have five harmonizers sitting around I do but I'm kind of hesitant to craft it because I do have other guns that I'm saving these for especially like raid ones because my luck is terrible with that. But yeah, if you do have a crafted, you can throw on a ballistics mod and get that bonus stability and range. So you'll have a total of like 81 stability, 81 range. Um, so that's really, really good. We have 75, 74. Yeah. Anyways, for people wondering mods, uh, I'm just using triple dexterities. Obviously on prismatic, I am using silence and squall. That's why, because, you know, disparity stasis. For you guys wondering about rolls and stuff, what you guys should craft, stay tuned because I will be showing you a full walkthrough of what to get on the disparity. See you guys in the gameplay. Enjoy. We uh, found a match. We got Anomaly. It's been a while since I played this map. Not sure how Pulse is going to work, but we got to make it work somehow. That guy's weak. Uh, our teammate got the cleanup kills though, so uh, it's a win for us. This guy's really pushing us. I'm going to... Hope he jumps up. Yeah, he did. We can probably slide up here. This guy's weak. We're getting shot from like every side of the map right now. These guys are definitely going to run through A maybe. But then we also got people coming up to the left here. Don't know what I'm witnessing here to be honest. This is brutal. Ooh. Dude, they are everywhere right now. I'm gonna just try and play bring around the rosy here for a second, get our health back. There's somebody up here. Already. This guy's weak. We got a shuriken on him. I'm gonna jump up here. True sight kind of saved us there. Ooh, looks like this guy's pushing up. I missed every shot. I don't know how I'm alive right now. We can probably proc kill clip. No, we ran out of time. Oh, you can two burst with the 450. I did not know that. Yeah, I guess if you hit every burst. A little harder than uh, LC's. Definitely has less aim assist if you're on a uh, controller. Here we go. We got kill clip, but I really don't want to re-peek this until we need to. Let's uh, back up here. Too many people. This guy's weak. Oh, we just got damage glitched. Try and push these hallways. I love retail tail. Good crouch on that guy's side. I'm almost uh, maybe lose that gunplay. I think someone's trying to push me from back here. Oh, definitely people up there. Let's uh, move away for a minute. Oh, that guy regretted his choices. Oh, good shots. With a 450, you definitely can outrange an LCs, but you have to hit every shot. Somebody here, maybe, in this little door. I hear him. Okay, he's down here. Where's everybody at? Yeah, someone's definitely running through A, right? Yeah. Here we go. I'm gonna try and loop around here. Catch somebody off guard, maybe. Yeah, right, this guy. He's gonna back battle. Good play. I think somebody's over here, maybe, yeah. 
That was a hawk man now. I don't know what just happened, but we got the kill. We have kill clip. There we go. Good shots. Teammates are making big plays here. I love to see it. Oh boy. No! No! That was actually the biggest sell ever. Dude, oh my gosh. No. Why? Why did that have to happen? Oh man. That's bad. That that's definitely not one I want to remember. I could have killed like half the team right there. Ooh. Guys weak. Try and throw a dust skill here, hold that door down so we don't get flanked. I find when you get kill clip proc, your aim assist is like really wonky, and I'm not sure why. Might just be a controller clutch, uh, crutch complaining. Oh, good blink on that guy's side. I love the new uh, UI design where it shows like what your teammates died to. It can be helpful. Oh, good shots, teammate. Let's push uh, catwalk. That's what it's called. Ooh, good shots. I love how like consistent this thing feels. Like it genuinely feels like if I hit every shot, I'm gonna get rewarded. I feel like a lot of pulse rifles like lack that. But you know, if I could hit a shot for a second, <laughs> I'll try and do something crazy here. Well, oh, not with that grenade. Is that? That's definitely an enemy. Is. Ooh, I'm choking. Easy shots here. I might be a little rusty, man. I gotta start playing more. They're spawning and then they're rotating back here, so. Ooh, we're getting pinched by two, three people. There's definitely gonna be somebody pushing right here, yeah. Somebody's jumping up here. I just gotta watch my right. Ooh, I'm almost dead to that fusion. Let's uh, get out of here. This guy's running through. Let's get our health back before we re-challenge this guy. Oh, he's pushing. He is pushing. Never mind. Yo, this guy is dedicated. I was low-key a good play on his side if I didn't have shotgun ammo. Oh, uh, is that a blade for you? Um, okay. Don't know how I survived that, but whatever. Okay, that's some crazy range. <laughs> if I died to that, I was going to be like, bro, no way. Someone's definitely running through A here. Throw a dust guild. Nope. I think my dust guild scared him away. Oh, he's so weak. Someone get that kill. Thank you. Good stuff, teammates. I love my teammates, dude. This good. Oh my gosh, the whole team's there. Let's try and do something crazy here. I just missed every shot. Wow. And there's a sentinel. Why is this saying they have a power player when they don't? <laughs> we have a super now. Try and make a play with our super before the game ends. I want to say they're spawning on A, so. Oh, that might have been a really bad super. Oh, we got someone with it. Oh, good shot, dude. Oh, this guy's so weak. I'm going to do something crazy here. Don't know how and uh, never do what I did, guys. It's very dangerous to do, especially in like a small range map. Oh, this guy did not expect the flank. Good dodge. I'm going to try and recap this zone here really quick. Definitely going to get pushed from... I don't know if that's a clone. Well, I think he's letting me get the zone maybe. Nope, definitely not. But we killed him. Oof. Did not let them get that power play. So that was good. Yeah, we won the match, so it was good. Though, I mean, quick play is quick play, right? Let's check out how we performed that match. We definitely did pretty good. I think we only died maybe four or five times, so. Yeah, I mean, we dropped to 6.8 with 34 kills. That was a really good match. GG's to those guys, especially my teammates. My teammates did crazy good that game, like, really good. But yeah, on to what you want to get on this gun. So, we loaded up D2 Foundry here. This thing can get so many perks, including Moving Target and Headseeker. 
There are so many fantastic roles that you can get on this thing. However, there are about three craftable roles I would strongly recommend you guys. For one, Rapid Hit. Rapid Hit is going to be very, very useful when it comes to getting those crispy two-shot taps, because you definitely need those two, uh, two taps. Then Head Seeker. Head Seeker is very strong on 340s, and it's pretty good on 450s. Now, if you cannot get a Head Seeker or a Rapid Hit roll, I'd recommend doing something like Moving Target Desperado or Moving Target Kill Clip. For your magazine, Accurize, and then just do Hammer Forged. This will give you a lot of range. If we check this out right here, we're going to have 85 range. And uh, yeah, we get that bonus stability. Then when we throw on our range of masterwork, 95, and then we throw on ballistics, you're going to have 100 range on this pulse. And it's already a very high zoom. So uh, yeah, it has 19 zoom, which is really good for 450. So you can get 100 450 zoom range. This thing is so good. Now when we uh, increase rapid hit proc times 5, you get 88 reload speed, 31 stability. Even times 1, you're still getting 8 and 5. So uh, yeah, definitely really, really good. These are the roles I'd recommend, but yeah, that's all. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Leave a like, sub to the channel. Have a great night. Check out our sponsor. Guardians, I would like to recommend you a fantastic service. To Bing.net, you can find teams to complete different activities like raids, dungeons, Trials of Osiris, exotic farming, and many more in-game activities. The best part about the service is it does not require you to share your account information whatsoever. You don't need to give your login or password to order a service that you like. All you have to do is select the self play option. To do this, select something you like. In this case, I'll do Crow Design. You're going to choose your clear option. I'll be doing the full clear, so click full clear. Then select the self play option. As you can see right now, we have $25. To get a discount, make sure you type in code HECTIC for a 15% discount here. As we can see right now, our total is $25.05. If we apply this coupon, we get $24, so you save a dollar. I would highly advise doing this. From here, you're going to choose a payment method. There's Visa, PayPal, and a few other payment options. In this case, we'll be using Visa. From here, agree to the terms and services, and then proceed to checkout. I would highly recommend Nimming.net, especially because the funnel shape is releasing and there's many awesome services that can be done. That's all for today, guys. I'll see you in the next one.